my name is Akintola Olawoleti Peter. You're welcome to our, to our educational TV channel, Scholars Cat TV. This afternoon, I want to take a look at conversion of numbers from one base to another base. Now, we have 11011 base 2 to base 5. Before we do, uh, do that, let me explain this to you. We first of all convert these binary numbers to base 10. From there, now convert it to base 5. How do you go? This is it. We have 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, base 2. So, the whole of this number, we multiply the base 2. After that, after we fi finally got our answer, she said, then we now proceed and convert it to base 5. And when we multiply, use everything to multiply this base 2, that is, we are converting it to base 10. Now, let us go. This one, we multiply, one, this one, we multiply this base, base 2. This one, we multiply this base 2. This 0, we multiply this base 2. This one, we multiply this base 2. This one, we multiply this base 2. This one, we now multiply this base 2. Now, let us multiply it. 1 times 2 plus... 1 times 2 plus 0 times 2 plus 1 times 2 plus 1 times 2 plus 1 times 2. Now let me explain this for you. Before we, we multiply everything, we first of all put our power here. That is the power start from the right hand side there, which is where we're going to put zero here. So one here, two, three, four, five. Shall we go? Now, which is what? One times two, put a power here. Zero, one, two, three, four, and a five. Now let us multiply everything. We have one times two power five. When we say 1 times 2 power 5, that's 2 times, a, we are going to multiply 2 in 5 places. That's 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. 8 times 2, 16. 16 times 2, 32. So 2 power 5 will give us 32. Now, we come here again. Write 1 times 2 power 4. Now, we are multiplying 2 in 4 places. That's 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. 8 times 2, 16. We have 16. Then this one, we have 0 times what? 2 power 3. That is 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. That's 8. Plus 1 times 2 power 2. That's 2 times 2. 2 times 1, 2. 2 times 2, 4. That's I'm going to write 4 here. Plus 1 again times 2 power 1. 2 power 1 is what? That's 2. That's 2 in 1 places. Then this one is now what? Plus 1 times 2 power 0. So anything power 0, any number, power 0 is what? Give us what? 1. So 2 power 0 give us what? That's what? 1. Any number, power 0 give us 1. Now let us go. 1 times 32, it give us 32. 1 times 16, we give us 16. Plus 0 times 8, we give us 8. Hey, that's 0, sorry. Then 1 times 4, we give us 4. 1 times 2, give us as what? 2. Then 1 times 1, we give us as what? Plus what? 1. Now let us add everything together. 32 plus 16 plus 0 plus 4, plus 2, plus 1, they give us 55. So, our answer is now what? 55, B is what? 10, because this, we convert it to what? To base 10. Now, in this place now, don't forget that we are converting it to base 5. You now come here, put your 5, then put your 5 here. 55, put your 5 here. Now come 5 in 55, the keyboard that's what? How many five can you say 55? Give us what? 11 remainder 
zero. Five and eleven will give us that's what? Two. Remainder one. Now, five and two will give us that's what? Nothing. So that's five is greater than two. So there's no way we can, five can go inside two. So now give us that's what? Zero, yeah? You now put that, sorry. It's a five here, sorry. You now put zero down here. Because five is greater than two. Then you now put remainder what? This two. Just put the two here. That's how it goes. Then you now draw your arrow sign. Because you're bringing it from the down. From the below. So you now have a... Now have one, one, zero, one, 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 base two to base five. To base five is what? Is two hundred and ten. Two one zero base five. Then do not forget to subscribe to our TV, uh, to our educational TV channel at Scholars Card TV. Thank you very much.